here we are at Furman University. I'm your host, Ferrari St. Paul, and this is University TV. Let's go on a tour, shall we? Furman University is in Greenville, South Carolina. It's the oldest, largest, and most selective private institution in the state and one of the top liberal arts colleges in the United States. Between classes, you can stop and smell the roses at the Furman Rose Garden. The gardener even lays out flowers for you to take home to your sweetheart. Furman is situated on a beautiful 750-acre wooded campus at the base of the Blue Ridge Mountains, with a 40-acre lake at its center and 32 major buildings, mostly constructed of handmade Virginia brick and designed by the folks that brought you Colonial Williamsburg. There's also an 18-hole golf course right on campus. Now get ready, so I'm gonna make this one. Oh, close. Furman enrolls approximately 2,600 students, 44% men and 56% women, from 46 states and 47 countries. Typically students have taken um, four out of the five highest level courses that are offered at their high school. Um, they have around a 3.7 unweighted GPA. 50% uh, of them have between a 1210 to 1400 on the SAT and between a 26 and a 32 on the ACT. Tuition at Furman is about $31,000 per year with an additional $4,000 for room and $4,000 for board. Furman offers majors in 41 subjects including Latin American, Classical or Environmental Studies as well as Education, Pre-Med and Pre-Law programs. Furman has a unique Asian Studies program. Students can find their place of peace in this Asian-inspired garden. <laughs> Despite its size, Furman is recognized among professional organizations for its chemistry, history, music, physics, political science, and psychology departments. The computer science department, too, has earned high marks. The faculty you know, at Furman's campus are great. First of all, they're very high, highly qualified. Um, very, very accomplished faculty. 97% of our faculty have their PhD or the highest degree in their field. Um, but because we are a largely undergraduate institution, um, all of our faculty are teaching the classrooms. We don't have teaching assistants. We don't have graduate assistants. It's those ex-professors right in there in class with you. Um, they care about their students. They're not out there to get you. They're there to challenge you. And so if you're not in class, you may get a phone call or an email saying, hey, were you sick? Is something going on? Um, they'll invite students over for barbecues, invite students over to present their final project in their living room to give it more of a community feel. And definitely they will give you their home phone number a lot of times maybe invite you over to their house um, as a class um, and get together and you can really just learn a lot from them and they're really willing to talk to you about life and really anything that you need help with here. Furman was ranked as one of Sports Illustrated top U.S. sports colleges. The Furman Paladins are strong competitors in NCAA Division I AA sports as members of the Southern Conference. Students at Furman are required to live on campus for all four years. You can choose based on uh, the type of uh, setup you want, whether it's suites or single or doubles. Therefore, it's uh, pretty neat also how we have a uh, survey you kind of fill out based on your preferences. Uh, if you go to bed early, what you like to do, hobbies. Uh, so they kind of pair you up with someone who meets your, uh, meets your expectations. And usually it works out. It worked out for me, so hopefully it'll work out for you all. There's two different sides of campus uh, for freshmen that they can live on. There's Lakeside, uh, which is behind me, and then South Housing, which is on the other side of the University Center. I really enjoy South Housing because there's the beach volleyball and then uh, a big field that you can, can lay out in or play soccer or frisbee, whatever you choose. Um, and then there's one dorm in, in particular, McLaughlin, which is the one that I live in. It has the biggest rooms on campus. Want to get involved? Student life at Furman is truly abundant with over 160 organizations. Oh, nice. <laughs> Even if you're not in any clubs, there are always plenty of activities on campus students can get involved in. Today, students are kicking off their shoes, hitting the sand, and serving up some fun. Worried about finding a job after college? Fear no more. Join Furman's on-campus career service and let the professionals guide you. They will hold your hand through the resume process, help build your interviewing skills, and set up practice interviews with local businesses. 
Many times, that can turn out to be the real deal. Furman students have been known to receive job offers following their practice interviews. Furman is changing its calendar, so two semesters, which is typical to what a lot of universities do, but where the plus comes in is that we're going to have a May master or a May experience. Um, it's going to be during the month of May, optional for students to, to stay, and they're only going to be taking one class during that month. But the neat thing is that it'll be a class that's not offered any other time during the school year. And so for students with a very specific interest in whatever their major is or whatever academic department they're studying, uh, the professors are going to really create sort of an individual program for them. They may study something for um, you know a month long time um, or they may do a field trip every day or they may go study abroad and so that allows for some, some neat flexibility as well. Well thanks for joining us here in Greenville, South Carolina on our tour of Furman University. I'm Ferrari St. Paul with University TV and you get out of here.